Tempting goblet misses. Mm. Mm. Who's in the coach? Lord of Time, the shield breaker. Could be. Except I think I'm going to recycle you, Lord of Time. We're going to get you in maybe as an abomination. I see you guys talking about that. I see you talking about that. Um, right, so we're going to go into the blacksmith. I think we're probably going to have to get Eric some relief here. Eric, what do you want to do? You want to you go beat yourself with a spike ball? You want to pray to a higher power? Glint and gold? Do you want to like go to the tavern and sort of gamble it all away? Actually, if we do that... Uh, let's bring that back. Let's not let you have that trinket that you can lose. Yeah, we'll, we'll let you gamble. Gamble. Your newfound treasures and such. It's okay, we can get more. And everybody else seems to be in an okay spirit. Despite what happened just a second ago. Embarking, what do we got? What's next? <laughs> Good job with whatever job. Thank you. Um... <laughs> Medium quest gets me a what? A dark bracer. Minus 10% damage if torches above 51. Then get myself geared up for some dark dungeon delving. Could do that. Blighting satchel. Grave robber only. We need to give something to the grave robbers. This needs to happen eventually. I don't know about right now though. Because this is a medium sized quest. And well, we're not ready for that. I'm, I'm thinking. Heavy boots. This is another medium-sized quest. You know what? I was talking about fresh air earlier. Can we have that now? Steady Bracer. Uncommon. Plus 10 range skills. Dodge and such. And maybe we can get an Arbalist in here. DK! What do you got going on, DK? That's not bad. Um, I need a, I need a, I need a tank. Sir Vainglory is undergoing syphilis reduction. Tracy Ian still happens to be fantastic as a tank. I could also bring Asuro in here as a tank. Main tank. The problem is I don't have anybody really there to heal, but I have a shit ton of damage. Doesn't matter if I try to heal if I've got that much damage. This is a 90. Hold on. That's a 90 as well. Do we have any shorts? I really like shorts. Plague Doctor only. Mmm. Plague Doctor. Speaking of which. Balamar, you haven't really done a lot. In a while. How about this cake fiend? We're gonna pop you in. We're gonna grab Balamar. Right. That's right. You don't have the ability that I want you to have, which is exsanguinate. We're gonna go get that right now. Uh, Asuro, there you are. Pop in there. We're gonna unlock exsanguinate. Buff it up. Punishing. Um, that definitely needs a buff. That one needs a buff. Extra extra bleeding and all that. Transfer, blight and bleed. There we go. Suffer two. Not bad. Also, Asuro, get some extra armor. Better weapon. DK, Cake Fiend. Um, Cake Fiend, you know what? I'm, I'm going to go ahead and buff you. Toxin Trickery. What does that do? It's dodge and speed. You know what? We're upgrading all your stuff as well. Cake Fiend, pop in. Okay. I'm all in. What a rush. Eric! <laughs> what are you doing? I hope you're winning money, not losing it. Balamar, you've got everything you need, right? Oh, no, you don't. However, you will. That's good. Asro, you just got what you needed. DK doesn't, can't get anything. Cake Fiend just got what they needed. I think now we're good for the embarkation. Right? So we got a really good tank up front. And protector, which is a tank, I get that, but enable, enabled to bring down or take away people's marked target as well as their, um, you know, uh, bleeding and blight and such. And we got Cake Fiend. Cake Fiend is good for basically murder. Um, Plague Doctor is good for you know, stunning and murder. And then, of course, DK, you're. Yeah, more murder. This is fine. This is good. Short. Plague Doctor, you're going to work for it there, Balamar. Balamar, you're working for your Plague Doctor only item. Right. <laughs> um, grab the food, and we're going to grab the torches, and then, hold on, can you actually do what you need to do from here? Flashing daggers, isn't that guard? You're in that one too. 
Poison darts doesn't actually work for you in that position. Toxin trickery does. I really don't know if I want to move you around. Maybe I should unlock the pick to the face for you. Or the lunge. The lunging is fantastic. You know what? We're going to do that. Let's pop in here. I just realized something. Cake Fiend. We're going to get you the... Um, or do I just do the pick to the face? The lunge is good, but... You know what? We're doing the pick to the face instead. And let's go ahead and set this up proper. So we can't do that. We're going to do that. Acero, we're not doing that, but we're doing that. Right. That seems appropriate. Embarking. Try again. I'm going to buy those, that. I got all the food and the torch, the light that I need. We're going into the cove, so I'm going to grab a, an extra shovel. And I'm going to buy... Oh, oh, wait, hold on. I don't need that many bandages. I don't think... I'm going to grab two, two more anti-venom, so a total of three. A key. And a laudanum. One laudanum. Just one laudanum should be fine. Okay, two laudanum. And a holy water, because of the pools. And I think that's it. Oh, and some medicinal herbs for the, <laughs> for the sushi. Go away. Embark. It's good. Oh, and we need jesters, too. That's right. So there's abominations, there's jesters, and what was the other one? There's so many classes. It's an incredible amount of classes. Did Briar say pig to the face? No. No, no, no. Not pig. Pick. The fiends must be driven back. And what better place to begin than the seat mm. of our noble line? All right, so we're not making a whole bunch of money this turn because, you know, Eric. Eric burned a book and felt bad about it. Understandable. Let's take a look inside that sack. What do we find? A meager sum of money. But it's still something. And then, and then, and then, and We're going to have a fight anytime soon? This hall was completely empty just about. T for torch, because that means that this room is going to be bearing down on us with its complete lack of nothing to do. Um, right then, we're going to move on to the west. What am I supposed to do? 100% of room battles? Why is this being so easy? What's the game doing? It's luring me into a false sense of hope. The confidence that I'm feeling right now is is Finding this not real. Is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. Ooh, my end. I scrawl this victim of cruel fortune who took me up on my wager for I have lost my lucky coin and I now lie helpless as my blood flows swiftly from my ruined body. My fingers are cold. It was no trap nor raving cultists that sealed my fate. We were ambushed by strange, undulating shapes. Two small entities that I could not or cannot hope to describe in a third, much larger beast. Poor Mora was crushed into a pulp as Therian defended her. He soon lost his arm and his wits left him. Shambla! Shambla! He kept shrinking as Raven yanked him to flee. I tried to play hero to buy them a few moments. Blew away one of the smaller monsters, but last shot. Then smashed into the wall. The big one. Maybe they made it out. Sadness. That's what that is. Mmm. There is nothing inside of this room. I could go north. There's a bunch of curios. Possible trap. We can get rid of that. Because we have Cake Fiend, who happens to be good with traps. What's in that? It's loot? Excellent. We got another page. They are sleeping. I am kept from slumber by a distinct stream of whispers, as if carried by the currents and waves of the sea. I have not told them that most of my flesh has slot off, revealing my strange, silvery membrane. I keep myself covered. They questioned me when I ate the meat raw at Campfall and found my response difficult to understand. I suppose it would be best to explain my condition when they awaken, when they would be convinced of my urgency to leave and find aid in the hamlet. Somebody might be feeling kind of ill. Um, right then. What is this good for? I'm pretty sure you use a holy potion thingamajig and it's going to be great. Let's see what happens if I take uh, DK. Take a look at that with a holy potion thingamajig. Hey, it relieves All right. Whatever. Good enough. There's a trap thing to unbreak, which is going to be 100%. You can't fail, Cake Fiend. Unless, you, of course, you did, and then that would be weird. 
I just want to end that sentence short. I just want to say, you can't fail, cake. Right? It's not a false statement. Mm -hmm. Next room is the room we've already been to. Um, we're going to go south. We're going to fight there, have that empty battle. Empty battle. That empty room. Ah, uh, okay. Here it is. Uh, T for Torch. 87. Purchase light. And set to plunder. Tempting goblet misses. Okay then. Four and five. And the uh, blighting, blighting or uh, blinding in the back. You've already gone. I don't really like it when you're back there. You know, a disorienting blast. That's decent. Not the best. Um, you can't bleed, so it's useless. I can punish you, however. You're not quite dead. That is an annoyance. Bump in the night misses. Hits, but it's okay. Asro did that on purpose. He stepped in front of the blow. I could now bowl us. Confidence surges Ooh. as the enemy crumbles. Thank you. Now look who's been neutered. This bone arbalist is all about the ranged combat. And is no longer ranged, you know? So therefore, that means we're gonna beat you down. In your meager ways. Um, are gonna be scattered all about this room. Destroyed. Cake! I love cake! Alright, um, so emboldening vapors, now we're gonna make sure that you don't get to do what you wanna do. There you go, come to the front. <laughs> Guess who's gonna get shot? Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Pick to the face. Another one falls. Cleared. Love it. Love it. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. Uh, read a book. It's great for you. Hey, an old journal entry. Okay. Aha! We tangled with some unruly louts. Raven called them cultists. They were ferocious but clumsy. Really? I mean, I, that many letters, that many words, I mean, you would think that it would be a, a, a poet. Poetry. We tangled with the fandangled unruly louts, but Raven called them poopy, and they all began to pouts. I'm not a poet. Whatever. Scouting. There's a battle to be done, plus another battle. Obstacle, do I have a shovel? I have two shovels remaining. I don't know. Let's get her done. Right. And fighting. Surprise they are. <laughs> so there's no sense to stun. Stunning is not going to do what I want it to do anyway. So we're going to embolden in vapors. Um, you. Enjoy that buff. You're going to flashing daggers. The ground quakes. They're almost dead. This is a beautiful thing. Um, I can now bring you down. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Dead, dead, dead. So you get to move. Bump of the night misses. Hey. You actually missed. Like that. Throw that dagger. Back to the pit. It just... It's... When it's just right. Okay. Success so clearly in being... Wait, hold on. Or is it merely a trick of the light? Are you telling me I don't have enough room for gold? I'm getting rid of the laudanum then. Alright, 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 alright. What's inside of here? We got a box. What's in the box? Oh man, what's in the box? I'm gonna go use a shovel on this. Even the cold stone seems bent on preventing passage. T for torch. Next battle. I think we got this one as well. I'm feeling like we we can we can totally clear this up. And yeah, do I play? No. Blind them. Greatness was met out this day. So you don't get to go, and then of course you don't get to go. They miss their turn. Flashing daggers. Four and seven. Almost dead. That means I can now rain of sorrows in the back, possibly kill you. Although that's only one damage, right? And you can't be bled. I'm an idiot. More or less. There we go. Move. Is broken. You didn't move. Maintain the offensive. This makes me sad. Oh, bump of the night. You hit for two. It's okay. 
Go ahead and brush your shoulders off. I can now murder who? You? Incoming. I can murder basically any one of these individuals. But which one do I want to murder? I pick you! Pick. I pick. I, I pick. Okay. Another abomination cleansed from our Tempting goblet. Alright. Splashing wine on my blood soaked chest. It's not really that bad. Disorienting blast. I can't get you. I can do you though, and then these go away, and then you're both vulnerable, so let's do that. Alright. Um punish you. Four points of damage. Can't quite kill you. Can't bleed you either. Although As the fiend falls, that looks up. A faint hope blossoms. That's fine. That is okay. Kick him. That was not a kick, but whatever. This expedition at least promises success. What's inside, Asero? What did you find? Trinkets and bubbles and no place to put them. Um Room Battle Curio. I'm gonna go ahead and drop the medicinal herbs. Grab the onyx. Going north. There's a trap. I think I should have known that. Carelessness will find no clemency in this place. I think I was pretty careless. Um You know what? Chances of you getting anything worse. Oh, you just get a little stress, no problem. Right? Same stuff. A little stress. It's okay, you weren't stressed enough. Having a little bit of stress means that you're going to be a little bit more survivable now. Right? Flashing daggers, two die. Executed with impunity. One dies. Whatever, bolus. Be gone, fiend. DK! Um. Seize this momentum. Hmm. Push on to the task's end. Uh, yeah. I'm just gonna burn both those. Grab the citrine that way. I haven't even used any of the food yet. We still got 12 food out of this whole damn thing. Room battle curio. Good to go. No problem, no problem. Picks! Both of those two. Flashing daggers. That glint. Now, I could disorienting blast. Make it where it's difficult. Especially if you go to the back. Although I like play grenade instead. Yep. Play grenade. A little bit of damage plus blighting. Slow death. Not really. That's four per turn. And we got a little bit of stress happening. A death by inches. Later, loser. Ren for the old gods. Hits the tank. Wonderful. It's too bad I can't exsanguinate. I really want to bleed myself. And um, we're going to rain of sorrows. No, we're going to punish you. Fine and dandy. You're super dead on your turn. I can now bowl this both of you. Or I can just shoot you and kill you. DK! Crit! Next turn. You're dead on your turn, so I'm just gonna pick you. Finished. It's done. It's over. Um, Disorienting Blast. Don't have to do any of that. Emboldening Vapors. There you go. Sniff this. It's a glorious smell. Smells of glorious. We're gonna mark you. That's right, you're marked for death. <laughs> the slow death. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. Unforeseen to them, maybe. I totally saw it coming. Cheval! Portrait! Continue! Please be open. It's slightly ajar. Yeah, okay. Hidden treasures! Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. What's in the bag? We get money. And that's it. We're out. Crushing it right now. More bones return to rest. Devils remanded to their abyss. Another 6,000 money. Certainly going up in life. Clap to me. If there is anything about this video that you did indeed enjoy, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more content such as this, and I'll see you again later. And if you're feeling super generous, please check out the Patreon site where you can support me if you have the means and know that I will be eternally grateful. Have a good day, have a good evening, wherever you are in the world. This is Briar Stone, signing out.